<laughs> so crazy about skating is it like I've never been to Omaha let alone to this random elementary school but I feel like I know this place like thoroughly yeah, this trail is called the 244 this first grind is the like very beginning of skating this guy Dave Cole Ash Look at this fucking thing. That dog is uh, not thrilled with me. Let me get out of here. It's so crazy, dude. 244. It's a uh, skating tourism bucket list item. I wonder if everybody skates it with that dog going crazy. Oh man. Just had a brutal conversation. Really sorry to everybody that's in pain right now. I think that's fucking everybody, dude. Like, I'm in pain. Always. I, my coping mechanism is fighting through it. I have my own coping mechanisms that I've developed in healthy and unhealthy ways throughout the years. Uh, but I can proudly say that I'm fucking resilient. And that the people who hurt me don't have as much power as they used to have. It's made me slightly lonely. I'm very cautious with how I engage the people. Um, but it doesn't mean that my heart has shifted at all. Like, the only thing that I have in my heart is love, empathy, compassion, and understanding because I know how fucking hard life is for everybody, man. Like, from every kind of friend that I have, I have a fucking giant, crazy smorgasbord of people I'm friendly with. It doesn't matter where they came from, what their fucking color, creed, or nationality is. Like, everybody suffers. Like, that's being a human. And it's completely okay. Um, but I think that... I think that what I gained from suffering at the hand of people I care for is that every time I've been hurt, I've made an effort to adjust my personality and my actions to not hurt people the way they hurt me. And now I'm the nicest motherfucker on the planet. How about that? <laughs> I decided to come on this northern route because I wanted to photograph the beauty of the natural environment the national parks. So I did all this research and all this planning and I figured I was coming out of, you know, like the off season, kids are back in school, it should be like pretty chill, pretty serene. And I started noticing all these motorcycles going by the whole way I've been coming here and I was like, yeah, I wonder if they're going to Sturgis. So I just looked it up and Sturgis is indeed this week. Um, so... very tempted to go to Sturgis <laughs> like at some point on this route I'm going to pass through Sturgis I feel like I kind of have to stop in and explore the madness uh, but also like I feel like this like thing that I wanted to make about like the beauty of the natural environment is now going to be juxtaposed with like the gnarliest fucking motherfuckers in America <sighs> okay photo we got
shit. Straight to the motherfucking Badlands. I gotta see if I was right about my gut instinct to do this. <laughs> for the old eye camper. Pretty crazy, man. That thing's been howling like this for hours. So that thing's pretty solid. wind was nuts last night. It's a bad camp spot. one sweet Harley photo. It's gotta happen. The American landscape and American iron sun. Yeah, I got a decent one. Nothing to write home about, but I don't have the patience um, for a motorcycle photograph. That's not why I'm here, but I'll post the one I got. Photography is a waiting game sometimes. Um, there's a consistency in the pattern to everything, and if you see something and miss it, usually if you're patient and just wait, it'll happen again. Maybe not the same exact thing, but sometimes something even better, so. trail there's this really sweet ladder on this trail there's a fucking zillion photos of it but I'm gonna make my own
gotta get out of this park. It's really good, but I gotta get all the way to fucking the coast in the next two days, so I got boogie. Alright. Leaving Badlands. Um stunning. Absolutely fantastic. Uh gonna have the crazy horse and not rush more. Supposed to get to fucking middle of Wyoming today. I don't know if it's gonna happen. Um, whatever. But uh, fucking roadie for the boys is in fucking in demand today. No. It's only appropriate to celebrate freedom when I'm on my journey into the national.